What's going on, my little piglets? It's your BFF Pork Chop here, and I'm coming at you with another food review. Back here again at Burger King to get the Whopperito a try. I asked two employees, and one said it was okay, and one said it looks so disgusting she's not even going to try it. So, high hopes. Just kidding. Probably no high hopes at all for this thing. But anyway, here it is. They didn't even give me a bag. I just told them just to give me the Whopperito. So here it is. This thing's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. And the Whopperito, for those of you that don't know, is pretty much everything on a Whopper inside this burrito. So let's open this bad boy up. Okay. <laughs> Looks like something out of Taco Bell. Look at that. This thing smells like a Whopper. But is it going to taste like a Whopper? This, this already has a hole in it, so we're going to go ahead and bite this. So without further ado, let's go. Mm. One complaint that I have so far is it's really chewy. It is a chewy Whopper. So if you don't like chewy stuff, I don't think you're going to like this. But so far, I have had the cheese and some of that flame broiled meat. There's the meat right there, so let's get another bite here. It's really kind of bland tasting, to be honest with you. I do like that meat though, like they, they ground it up. The Whopper taco meat is what they made here. Ultimately, it tastes like that they went to Taco Bell and got a regular burrito and then came back here and put their Whopper meat inside of it. This thing did come to 324, so this thing's 299. So far, it's just nothing really to shout at home about. It's a new item and I think it's got to be an acquired taste. Like, people are going to either love this or hate this. Let's do the pros and cons here, okay? Pros here. That beef is awesome. I love flame broiled. That's why I like Carl's Jr. and Burger King, because the flame broiled meats. I do like the crunch of the pickle that is inside of this. The crunch of the pickle is really great with the cheese as well as the beef. Something new. It's something new to try. So, uh... Yeah, if you guys want to give this a shot, go for it, and then let me know down below what you guys think. Also, the onion mixed with the beef is fantastic as well. Cons here are, this is an acquired taste. I am not jumping on the wagon. This thing is, it's it's a gimmick. They're just going to try to sell as many of these as they can and then get out. Probably this thing will be a limited time thing, and then it's, it's gone. Just like I didn't even have a chance to get the mac and Cheetos done because they were in and out so fast. I would probably have enjoyed the mac and cheetos better than this so they should have kept the mac and cheetos and just left this alone they need to stop doing the dr moreau experiments here at burger king they should just stick with what works and then sell them like hotcakes keep the whoppers on the bun hashtag keep the whoppers on the bun <laughs> i just made that up another con as well is i'm not getting this again definitely not gonna get this again this is just a one and done i, I always say that i said that once zombie land reference if you haven't gotten it already that's about it. It really sucks though because my boy Tony Tone told me about this and uh, he was all excited about it and I read the article about it. It sounded fantastic but it's just it's all sizzle no beef no steak. How about that? Okay so on a scale of one to ten piglets I'm gonna have to give the Whopperito from Burger King. Mm, this bad boy is getting a five out of ten. I think this is the lowest thing that I've ever reviewed. This is the lowest rating I've ever given anything I reviewed. What'd you guys think about it? Let me know down below. Let me know on Facebook, Vine, Twitter, and Snapchat. And if you're not a piglet and you are interested in seeing the rest of these videos, hit that subscribe button right there to become a piglet to stay in touch with my videos. You can also go like me on Facebook, follow me on Vine, Twitter, Snapchat. All those links are down in the description. And if you have a food recommendation, let me know and I will get to it. And you could potentially get a shout out in the next food review. So always remember my little pickle. It's called Pork Shop. Loves y'all the most. So y'all take it easy, guys. And I will see y'all next time. Bye, guys.